Alrighty, folks, welcome on back to Darksiders 3. Now, if you remember, at the end of the last episode, I did not want to drop down here just yet. Um, even though we can easily get back up, I wasn't sure. See? 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 Whoa. Okay, this is going to be interesting. Come on. Oh, ow. Let the little ones settle in. Ow. Come on. Ah, thought I dodged that one. I can get hit one more time. See? This might help. Ow. I'm not doing very good on this guy. <laughs> Every time I try to dodge, I don't dodge. <laughs> All right. Well, I figured out that if you blow the little guys up next to him, uh, it does some damage to him as well. Why does sloth have to be bugs? I mean, I'm not scared of bugs or weirded out by bugs or anything, but... It's just why does it oh we're all the way back here? Oh, man. Okay. Well let's get these guys real quick. Alright. Come here, you. There we go. Get them. I don't know if I need this guy. So we're going to leave him for now. I want to make sure I got the human. In here. Because we didn't check that last time when I died. I did. Okay, good. Hopefully here soon we get a way to deal with the webs without using the little bombs. Uh, because, for example, the one from here, I actually can't make it all the way back. Oh. Okay. That was nice. Dang it, I thought I dodged that. All right, you know what? Just go away. Oh, she looks cool. Let's save some of it. Dislocate your arm, patting yourself on the back. How do you plan on dealing with that, my bloodthirsty mistress? A rejuvenation core. Also increased vigor, which is upgrade Nephilim's respite's healing amount. Okay. This stone automatically increases the amount of health restored by Nephilim's respite by 75. Hmm. Okay. 
And did that thing pop or did it run away? I know there's one up there, but there were two in here. There were two, I swear. Now, it might be possible that they broke. I don't think I'm going to be able to toss him up there. No, no. Go for the goo, not me. I thought he was going for me. Whoop. All right. I need another one. <laughs> I wonder if I could just, like, slash him. Okay. So that's one way forward. I'm going to see if I can toss him up there. I don't know if he throws in a straight line or if he arcs. Hey. I kind of need you to come eat this stuff. Alright, fine. I'll throw you at it. Eat that. Alright, let's try an arc first. Nope, straight line. Okay. Okay. And I would have gotten hit if I went back any further. He was getting close to blowing up. So, let's see what's up in here. Small healing shard. Um, Alright, what else do we have? Another small healing shard. And these two give me a medium lurcher clump. Oh, no, you don't. I don't care about you at the current point. Wow, those come back quick. Okay. So those regenerate. Can you get your omnoms. Seriously? Thank you. <laughs> I was going to say... Okay, let's go. I want to know how fast these actually come back. That's pretty quick. Ah, okay. can't double jump either. Which means we wouldn't have been able to grab onto the ledge. Which means I have to go back around. I also found out that this is just slightly faster than running. Oops. So I can't attack that and have him come out. Okay. So that is a timed thing. does arc, but just slightly.
Hmm. I wonder if I could touch him to it. Try something. Run through here. We're not going to make it. All right. Well, that idea didn't work. How are we supposed to do this? I stand right here. Okay, well, I killed myself with that one. <laughs> I wonder. Okay, I have an idea. And it's to toss the one on the ground up and then go through. Of course, we're back here with no souls. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. That's fine. Come here, guys. Still don't understand how they managed to do that, but... You know, it is what it is. Oh, I don't even have Fury Mode or anything like that back. Chaos Form, nothing. It wasn't called Chaos Form, it was called something else. Oh, and the two skulls are gone. But so is this thing. So at least I don't have to worry about that. I just have to figure out the puzzle. Did that work? I don't think so. Nope. Okay. No, 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 no. Do not go after that. Oh, crikey. Nope, nope, nope. Didn't throw him high enough. Wait, what? Did he just fly through the ceiling? No, he's up here. Okay, good. Nope, nope. You stay there. Don't come down here. Yes. All right, let's see if I can get this to work. All right, do these have anything new in them? And there is one more cluster. But I don't want to hit just yet. Or I don't want to hit the bug, I should say. He didn't stay up. Of course not. Okay. So how are we supposed to get through this puzzle then? I have two of these and one place to go. I need to go through back there. All right, let's try this again. I'm not going to make sure that he makes it up there. Like I did last time. We're just going to throw him. Or not.
I guess not works as well. Oh, I actually want you... As... Why does it light up there, but not when I'm, like, way up here? Huh. Well, that's interesting. Nope. Sorry, dude. Can I dodge like this? I'll drop him. <laughs> I keep hitting the wrong buttons. <laughs> there we go. Okay, he's now up top. Let's see if I can do this the way that I want. I kind of doubt it. Oh, crud. Are you still up there? Can't destroy that one that way. This one puzzle. Hey, come on. Come get your food. Little silly thing. Alright. He is indeed gone. I wonder how easy this actually is. And I'm probably just making it really hard. But, there's no way to, like, destroy this or anything. So, before I accidentally kill myself again... Let's go back to Vulgrim. And spend some of our souls. There must be something that I'm... Not necessarily missing, but that I just haven't found out yet. What would you ask of this? Um, this will be fun for both of us. All right. Now, if I lose a whole bunch of souls, we should be good. as you wish. Uh, let's put this in our cane. Well for now. <laughs> Bye, Volgrim. Okay, yeah, you see an angel and a demon fighting over there? Because I did. Uh, how are we supposed to do this? There's got to be something that I'm missing. Like, there's a way to jump with them or something. Yeah, I can't do double jumps. Oh! Wow. I'm an idiot. This whole time, I've been trying to get him to come up here through the web. But it's not through the web. Go eat, dude. Oh, you're going to come after... There you go. There we go. That was so much simpler than I thought it was. Oh, and look, now we're on the other side. Of course, you know, heading right towards where the angel and the demon are both fighting. Ah, music to my ears. Feel the burn of heaven and he does enjoy dismembering angels. 
angels. We all need a hobby. I hope you've left something for me. I'll try not to enjoy this too much. <laughs> Find a troll, witch. Oh, that is unfortunate. Oh boy. Uh, okay. At least he's not too terribly hard. Ouch. Ow. Ow. Heal. Waging war, can't you tell? Wow. Some of these are really, really close. Ow. That actually hurt. There we go. I only had to use both of my healing guys. Rampage! Your master summons you! We ride! you remember in between screams. My siblings used to refer to you as the dumb one. Ah, <laughs> yes! The harder you fight, the stronger I get. I'll tear you apart! <laughs> oh, you think you're angry? <laughs> you barely scratched the surface. <laughs> That had to hurt. Both. <sighs> we were set up. War. The others. There are great forces at work here. Watcher. Help. Mistress! Oh boy. Something is wrong with the world. Delicate order is imbalanced. Oh, there's a sprint mode? <laughs> okay. It's L3 is sprint, huh? Step forward. Now I ask of both angel and demon. Do you arrive here of your own free will? The tenants of the Hollowing demand it. I do, Lord of the Hollows. As do I. You have both fought this war since the dawn of time. You are weary. Yet, immortality prevents the ultimate respite. The Lord of the Hollows alone can bestow upon you this gift. The final release. 
No longer will your souls be recycled time and time again to fight for heaven and hell. They are now mine. Hmm. What is he carrying, by you the way? You are finally free! Some giant sarcophagus? Ah, the impetuous creature awakens. Deluded pawn of the charred council. Do you even know where you are? I know exactly where I am. The stench betrays you. The Hollows is a hell all its own. Indeed. But it is one that I alone rule. What did you do to them? Nothing that they did not wish for. <laughs> you wear your ignorance on your face. The true consequences of this so-called war for balance are beyond your comprehension. Perhaps I should hollow you. A Watcher. This only confirms what I already held to be true. You are just a puppet. The Council is playing you. To further their own machinations. Enough! Unlike you, I have not come to this place for personal gain. The seven deadly sins must be eliminated once and for all to protect the balance you mock. I will not be deterred. She speaks the truth, O oh Lord, and she is tenacious to say the least. Your words carry no weight with me, they stink of lies. Interesting. Prove your commitment to balance. As the watcher leaves. Of course, because we're left to fight our own battles. I bet this is more than just fighting. <laughs> this is more than a test of battle. A demonstration, horseman. You are so quick to combat. Your whip ready to crack. True righteousness requires true insight. If this was a test, you have failed. To resist a call to raw impulse <laughs> is a different type of strength. Spare your wisdom. I know my strength, and when I prove it to the Council, I alone will lead the horsemen. The Seven will be destroyed, along with their designs for a world far more hideous than the Apocalypse we already know. Very well. You will need this. Is that the ability to go through webs at will? For what purpose? Even I am aware that there are times when sides must be chosen. Take this weapon, and know that I have chosen mine. But take heed, horseman. The universe has so many faces. Your survival depends on what you have learned here. You must open your eyes to much more than that which gazes back at you from the mirror. Fine. Can we go now? I Not like her hair now. There is the matter of Abraxas to discuss. Abraxas. A demon meddler. If Earth is to remain intact, he must be dealt with. He threatens your balance. His very soul must be brought to me. I see. And you want me to do it? Who better? I'll consider it. No guarantees. Then you and your watcher be gone. <laughs> hmm. Flame Hollow. Press L1 and circle to activate Flame Hollow. 
Press triangle to perform an attack. Hold triangle to perform a charge attack. All right. And we just got... I guess it's up. Uh, it's not up. Do I have to literally go back and... Of course. <laughs> I mean, why would they make it easy on me, right? All right. Let's see here. Collect the Flame Hollow. That's what it was. All right. So it was L1 and Circle. R1, L1, the fire and Circle. Hollow. Something changes when I hold it. I can feel its power coursing through my hands. All right. Oh, nice. Do, 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 I feel do, do, do. nothing. <laughs> like wading through a pond. That's awesome. Press and hold X after jumping to perform a flame jump. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Incredible. All right, what about distance? Can that cover distance? Not really. Oh, I can just straight up hold X. All right. Well, let's get out of here real quick. Or at least to a Vulgarm point. That's what I would like to do. There we go. All right. Well, I am going to end today's episode off here. If you folks have enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button down below. If you're new to the channel, consider subscribing and checking out some of my other content. And as always, I will catch you folks in the next episode. Stay frosty out there.